I'm still a little stunned. Um, I think I, I heard there were more than 900 dissertations last year. I'm interested in oncofertility fertility research because my mother had cancer. And when I started my PhD, this problem was presented to me. And I thought about my mom. And if she had cancer 10 years earlier, me and all my brothers would likely not be in existence. So what that is, is the preservation of female eggs for cancer patients. So the problem right now is when you have cancer, they will surgically take it out and then they'll have to do some kind of chemo and radiotherapy. And this is non-targeted therapy, but it's designed to kill fast growing cells, which is cancer cells. You want that. Coming to Michigan, I was very surprised by how supportive the mentorship here was. My graduate experience at the University of Michigan was fantastic. I would say it's cliche to say, but it's some of the best years of my life. When I joined my lab, I was basically given free reign of everything in the lab with, with the caveat, try not to break anything too expensive, just go have fun and report back when you find something interesting. My involvement in Rackham was uh, that Rackham supported a significant amount of my research with the equipment grants that uh, I did as a doctoral candidate. To be a Michigan alum is a great privilege. Other Michigan alums will go out of your way to help you and there's already this immediate connection.